wrestling fans, we're back with NWA on fire this week, and none other than Matt and Brian, the Logan brothers, kicking off the show, Tommy Savoli. Yeah, that's me, Tommy Savoli, Ricky O. Uh, this ought to be a good match. Um, I, I, I love watching the Logan brothers work. And this week, they're challenging for the tag team gold as they face none other than the Latin Kick Squad. They are two of the toughest tags in professional wrestling today. Bar none, any organization, they are four of the best in the business. Absolutely. The Logan Brothers, the crowd favorite. I can't tell you folks, NWA on fire at AOL.com. There must be 50 to 100 emails a day from girls wanting to know when and where they can see the Logan Brothers. I tell you what, these two young men really have it made, I tell you. I don't think they have too much trouble finding dates, do you? Not at all. Absolutely not. And there we see one half of the tag team champions, Nico, as he gets ready to take on Brian Logan. What a way to kick off the show. I tell you what, when the person come up with the phrase, street fighters, they had these two gentlemen in mind. Absolutely. The Latin hit squad, where there's one, there's always two. And with the Logan brothers, they know it's not one-on-one -on -one right now, folks. I'll guarantee you before this show is over, we're going to see all four of these guys in this ring. You got that right, Rick. Tommy, let me start off by saying April 25th, the Augusta Armory. I am waiting. I am waiting. I have so much anticipation for this. August 25th is going to be one of the hottest night in professional wrestling. Absolutely. No escape at the Augusta Armory. We're going to have the Logan Brothers against the Latin Hit Squad. The belts are on the line, and the Samoans are banned from the building. That alone is worth the amount of admission. I tell you what, I pay. We're going to gonna see charge it anywhere. We're going to charge you now that you said that, Tommy. We've got also on that card. And when in the world have you ever heard us say also? They're not in the main event. Justin Farina, Fuller, Big Rick Fuller. Big Rick Fuller. These guys there. are not even in the main event that night. And they are main event. Main event talent anywhere in the country, guys. We've got none other than the barbed wire match that's going to settle it all. What a night this is going to be, Ricky. I'll tell you what, this, this is going to be a night of all nights. Absolutely. The former cousins, the scuffling hillbillies, no more. Sonny Roselli, cousin Larry, barbed wire not only wrapped around the ring on the ropes, Tommy, but the NWA has gone out and bought extended poles that are going to raise 10 feet off the ring. And they're going to go tomorrow night and wrap them in barbed wire. And there's no escape, Tommy. Hence the name. This, this is, is going to end the feud, Tommy. This is going to be an event. This Tomorrow be event. night, Augusta at the Armory. Folks, you don't want to miss it. Apollo against the Giant Feral. And Tommy, we've just been handed one more semi-main event. Nordy Adriana has gone out and got a tag partner. Oh, boy. It's going to be a four-girl tag team match. The first time on NWA on fire we've got a women's tag match for the toughest ladies in the world alexis and the full beauty barbie wow are going to take on none other than norgie adriana and luscious latasha luscious latasha that's a heck of a name you're going to love this one i'm going to love that sound i know like you're not refereeing it because i need you right next to me tomorrow night at the Augusta Armory, Tommy, me and you live, NWA on fire. Folks, you want to be there. You got to be there. It's going to be a big, big night. Biggest night Augusta's seen in many a moon. We'll be right back. NWA on Fire returns to Portland, Maine, Saturday night, July 25th at the Stevens Avenue Armory. In action, the 7'1", Giant Pharaoh, heavyweight champion Apollo, Big Rick Fuller, making a special appearance, Mr. Backlund, the Latin Hit Squad, the Golden Boy, Makua, and Dynamite, Tim Arson. Saturday night, July 25th, Stevens Avenue Armory in Portland. Be there. Back inside the ring, Brian Logan putting a beat down right now on Nico, one half of the tag team champions. Ah, but Nico reversed that one. Did you see what he did there? Dropped him head first onto head the turnbuckle. Head first into the turnbuckle. You know, in Puerto Rico, they raised some pretty tough cookies. It's a nice match to call tonight, Tommy, because we can actually tell the Logan brothers apart. There's only one of them in the ring. I tell you, I get confused every time they're in the ring. I don't know which is which. And they're not even twins. Nope, not at all. Big clothesline right there by Nico. Took Brian right down. This Nico's one tough dude. 
We'll see how tough he is tomorrow night in Augusta when the belts are on the line. I tell you, folks, got to be there in Augusta tomorrow night. Don't miss this one. You'll kick yourself in the morning. You don't get there tomorrow night. Going to be one of the biggest wrestling events in, in Maine in a long, long I'm gonna time. I'm going to go on a line and say it's actually the biggest NWA event in the history of Maine. Oh, yeah. It is. That, I would say I would say you're right. Absolutely. I would say you're 100% right. we got four of the greatest matches they're ever going to see. Charges in right there. Which, oh, Tommy he dropped an elbow straight into the groin. That should have been a disqualification in my book, Tommy. Well, you Wraps know, him up, Nico. One, two. He's a better man than me kicking out right there, I Brian Logan. He, he's got to be hurt. He's in big-time pain right now. But you know what? This Brian Logan is one tough cookie. He's going to come back. Tommy, tomorrow evening, the feud that's been building for almost a year. Sonny Roselli, cousin Larry, the family business comes to a conclusion. No escape this time. Bob wire all around the ring, 10 foot poles, there's no way out. You can get in, but you're, you're not, not getting, getting out. out. And you know what? The winner of that match might turn out to be a loser. Well, they're gonna be beaten and bloody. I think so, I think there's gonna be a lot of blood in that ring, I really do. Absolutely, folks. Again, non-sanctioned barbed wire match. The family feud needs to come to an end. Sonny Roselli against Cousin Larry. It all comes to a head tomorrow night in tomorrow Augusta, night. Maine at the Augusta Armory. 7.30 bell time, folks. And these two right here will be back at it. But in tag team title match, Brian Logan, they're looking to regain the belt. The Logan brothers, they want the belts. And the Latin hit squad, they want to successfully defend those titles because... They're heading back to Puerto Rico. Hey, oh, here Look he is. This. Chico's hit the ring. You were I right. guaranteed it, Tommy. You were right. You were right, Ricky. Oh, you were the right. Disqualification right there. But you know what? It's a psychological advantage right now. Going into tomorrow night's match in Augusta, they're going to go in fresh knowing that they put a beat down on Brian Logan. They're looking to weaken him for tomorrow night's matchup, Exactly. Tommy. They just want them to know what they got in store for him tomorrow night. Tomorrow night's going to be one big night. At oh, here's Tommy. Here comes the other half of the Logans. Oh, my God. We've got all four of them. I knew this was going to happen. Whoa, time. this is a preview of tomorrow night. I tell you what, tomorrow night's going to be one big night at Augusta Armory. Brian back to his feet. Here we go. Air Logan. Listen you hear the, the crowd. crowd just going Listen crazy, to the crowd. Could the, you imagine the mayhem tomorrow night in Augusta Armory? Could minute, you imagine that? The minute I saw this match was signed, I knew we were going to see all four of these guys. Oh, yeah. They're street fighters, and that's how they work. There's no way Matt's going to let his brother, no way he's going to let his brother be taken advantage of like that. But you know what, Tommy? Tomorrow night, for the first time, they can go in with a clear content. I tell you, folks, you've got to be there tomorrow night. I tell you, it's going to be one of the biggest wrestling events in Maine in quite a few years. If you don't go, I will tell you, you're going to be kicking yourself in the morning. But, Tommy... The Logans can go in with a clear head knowing the Samoans have been barred from the building. The police at the doors have been shown pictures. They're not allowed in the this building. Time, they well, can actually concentrate on NWA the Latin Preston, Hit Squad and the Bob NWA Tag Titles. They know they're going to get a fair shake this time. For the they first time. Into a tag team contest. Wait a minute. We've just been informed they're restarting this match. And it's going to become a tag team match right now. Unbelievable. Folks, we'll be back. NWA on Fire returns to Mexico, Maine at the Mexico Recreation Center Friday night, July 24th with a 7.30 p.m. start. See in action the 7'1 Giant Pharaoh, Heavyweight Champion Apollo, the Latin Hit Squad, Dynamite Tim Orsons, Makua, and all the 